And with that, welcome to Rainbow Heritage, a hack that is still for the fourth hack gem that we're going to get right into. Shake, 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 shake it, shake it. Spinder special coming right up. Hey, but about the usual, I suppose. Thanks, but I'm only here for mail delivery today. Here's the letter for you. I'll be off. I'm pretty busy today. See you. <laughs> Whoa, a letter. I never get any of these. Now that's right. Hey, Wolfhead, I got a letter. Uh, I gotta open it right away. Dear Spinder, as you know, meeting the legendary ho -Oh has always been my biggest dream. And today, this dream has finally come true. ho -Oh was standing right before my eyes and they've t even talked to me. None of this would have happened if this random rescue team hadn't saved me. Tell me about your hopes and dreams uh, the next time we meet, Spindler. I've attached a little present for you. Life is short, so don't forget to follow your dreams. Your uncle Spindler from Pokemon Square. A present? What could it be? It's the Rainbow Wing. Uh, legends say that uh, only the holder of this legendary artifact can summon ho -Oh. Man. What am I even doing here? I'm wasting my life away in this cafe while everyone else is out there exploring the world. I love this place, of course, but every day is kind of the same. Maybe it's time for me to go on, on to an adventure too. That's right. You think so too? Okay, that settles it. From now on, I am a new spinner, and finding ho -Oh will be my first adventure. But first... Uh, I gotta find an explorer who will help me get through these treacher treacherous dungeons. This Rotom looks like different places. The Lumise over there is a famous explorer. Flagon now forces to be wrecked with. And Pidgey is also uh, present in this room. <laughs> so who should I take with me? I think I recognize every single one of these references, and I'm going with the one that can bend reality. Flygon! <laughs> Flygon it is. You've ruined everything. I took the worst job on the entire planet to learn all the intricacies of juice making. Just for you to blow the thing up? In a credit scene? Seriously. Dude, chillax, you can make a new one, okay? Mystery mail references for those who don't know. <clears throat> hey Flygon! <laughs> I am Marquis. As the ultimate life form, I deserve to be addressed as such. Wait, this is perfect. You're a spinner, aren't you? I command you to show me the way of the Juice veteran. Sure, and our first stop is Mount Far Away in the Wind Continent. Perfect, let's be on our way. Salvation is near. Well, uh, alright. Uh, okay. I guess we have Teeter and Scopicat Flagon and Psy Beam. Can we talk to Marcus? I use Arch, by the way. <laughs> My IQ is over 5000. Yeah, nothing more sad. <laughs> but still a nice detail. So those who do not know Marcus should probably um, watch Mystery Mail. It's definitely worth it. For some reason my controller has connectivity issues. Eh, anyway. Alright, um... Hmm, slowed. And is it just me, or am I have quite low health for a level 20 
Platz Pokémon. Same with Markus. Okay, you could maybe not use a dig on a levitating Pokemon. Good. Wait a minute, how long is this dungeon? 40 floors, I think. Or was it 60? No worries, this dungeon has hidden tunnels that are almost as convenient. Just gotta find the hidden stairs. Now oh, that sounds great. Oh wait, it doesn't. Don't despair. Lo and behold, the latest invention of Project P technology. The hidden stairs radar. This amazing device will draw an exclamation mark icon whenever we are near the hidden stairs. It'll help us get through this dungeon in no time. Alright. Does it actually have like 60 something plus floors or what? Man. Alright. So it says. Oh! Alright, secret tunnel. That's pretty cool. Alright, I confuse it and it still just hits me. 1 in 8 chance or something. Right. Why is beside me? Okay. I do want to find hidden stairs, and my map was gone for a second. Interesting. Uh, good. Level 24 Pokemon, I see. Somewhere in this room, then, are hidden stairs. Why did the Mimic fail? Hmm, anyways. Stairs! Okay. Alright, we gained quite a few. Extra... Um, ...floors. Ah, right, hey, great. Why did... Why did I even use hail? Can I even not heal it or not? I think I actually can't heal. <laughs> Shit. Alright. Nice. 
And also somewhere in this room, which is good. Let's go. Floor 24. I'm almost dead. We leveled up, I guess. And I would really like to avoid wasting <clears throat> the reviver seeds I already got. Alright, now I spawn next to stairs. Great, man, I love this. Alright, um, good. Peter Dance is actually very useful. Ah, right, it is in here. Nice, nice. Marcus. That is not good. Okay, I do still have three reviver seeds. And I can probably eat the plain seed to have like a few points restored. Right. Nah, hidden stairs probably not gonna be in the same room as the actual stairs. And my belly is empty. Uh, unfortunate. Elixir, I guess. And I should actually eat an apple. I'm gonna take some distance to not, you know, die. And apparently, it does look like we actually need to. Yeah. Alright. I use Teeter Dance, but alright. Please, no. God. <sighs> Alright, I'm running already out of Reviver Seeds again. I only have one left. And you are actually still sleeping here. You know, if I would have actually went this way, I would have still, uh, I would still have all my revival seats. But well, I had to be stupid. All right.
Uh. Good. My IQ is over 5,000. Indeed it is. Alright. Seems like we've reached the peak, so we got the shorter version uh, after all. My controller has actual connectivity issues, man, that's annoying. Excellent! You've done well to come this far. You've overcome countless challenges, fought through many dangerous situations, and finally ascended to the, uh, to the very peak of Mount Faraway. <clears throat> However, this is not the end. This is still, by the way, dungeon mode, not overworld mode. Interesting. I am whole. The builder of rainbows across the sky. It's so right in front of us. A creature almost as majestic as me. Silence. Only when you overcome me in battle. This, uh, that is when this mountain is conquered. This is the final challenge. Here I come. It's a cataclysm. While the master of this dungeon is bathed in light, its HP will be restored and its bad statuses will be healed. Alright, I see. Um, I have about nothing I can do to stop him from healing, I guess. <laughs> That's interesting. Because I don't think I can change the weather. That's very cool. But I guess that means that I actually can't win because... I mean, could I? I mean, it doesn't matter what I do. Actually heals fully, yeah. <laughs> Wait. Can I use orbs? Would be dumb if I could. Nah. Unfortunate. That would actually mean I would need like a move to change the weather, which I do not have. Hmm. Alright. Oh, I can continue without but, um, all right. You have failed my challenge. Now be gone. But, but who? Oh, there is so much I want to learn from you. I will not waste any more time on weaklings like you. Leave now if you hold your liver's life dear. I'm sorry, Ho. Oh. Let's go, Marcus. Okay. Sh shake this way. Sh shake. I, I just wanted to talk to Ho and I'm a complete failure. I'll never achieve anything in my life. I'm stuck in this cafe forever. I suppose I should have prevent I should have pre prevented you from having 15 drinks. This juice is banging you. You're going to bed now. Uh, tomorrow you will teach me how to make uh, the deadliest juice on this planet. F fine. What the fuck? <laughs> I guess you should <laughs> What? What the fuck is happening? <laughs> Fine, ask me anything. 
Uh, oh? What are you doing here? I suppose I've treated you unfairly. Besides, I do not want to have a reputation for getting angry at visitors for no particular reason. Well, legendaries with anger issues. Where have we seen this before? <laughs> now, is there anything that you wish to know? Otherwise, I'll be on my way. Yes, of course. Thank you, Hole. Hmm, what should I ask? There's so much I want to know. Ah, I know. I'd like to know about your history, Hole. Where, um, were there any other ho before you? And what were they like? Very well. <clears throat> there has been a long and proud lineage of my kind. I will tell you the story of an ancestor who lived in an extraordinary turbulent per period of time. English. A long time ago, three nations were engulfed in constant wars. Man. The Grass Kingdom inhabited uh, the landmass known to, uh, as the Grass Kingdom. Uh, it was known as the most peaceful kingdom. The Fire Kingdom was small, but it was a force to be reckoned with. The inhabitants took great pride in the land. Although the islands of the Sea of Wonder belonged to the kingdom, most of the population lived on F uh, Fire Island. Did your ho -Oh ancestors live there too? One might think so, but, it's not, but it is not the case. In actuality, my ancestors took a liking to the inhabitants of the Water Dynasty, who built golden towers for them. The story I will tell you begins in what appeared to be a brief period of peace. Yo! Alright! Rainbow Heritage. Oh, alright, alright. <laughs> uh, General, uh, General Zamorot. There have been suspicious enemy activities around our borders. I'm confident that the Fire Kingdom will uh, attack on our village. What? I'm confident that a Fire Kingdom attack on our village will soon follow. These activities are most concerning. Let us keep observing the borders, but keep away from rash actions. It seems like another war between the three nations will soon break out. When will we finally reach an age of lasting peace? General Samurot, how are you planning to take on the Fire Kingdom? Will you defeat them with a surprise attack? Young Bellsprout, we will not resort to hasty actions. General Zamorot, please play with me. Yes, please show us how you command units in battle. Oh, play fight. Yay, Cuban and I will play the evildoers from the Fire Kingdom. No, <laughs> I do not engage in such frivolities. Are you certain, General Zamorot? It might help you take your mind off current struggles. Besides, a play fight might serve as an important refresher if the situation were to... Excurbate, I guess. Very well. Bellsprout and Pichu shall fight against Cubon and Polywag under my guidance. We will begin now. You will take your last breath today, scum of the Fire Kingdom. We will smash your skulls and bathe in your blood. <laughs> Preparation phase. What is... Okay, that, that, that took an interesting turn very quickly. Uh, it is time to prepare for battle. Jana General Zamurot, may I remind you of your role as our commander? You act as an overseer who places units on the battlefield. However, you cannot actively participate in battles. Yes, I remember. It is now the children's turn to share their knowledge of warfare. <laughs> what might be an advantageous position for the two of you. Oh, I know, I know. I could take out Cubone with my Vine Whip, it's super effective against it. And there's even a Red Miracle tile that will raise my offensive stats. But Pichu might be in trouble. Cubone can absorb her electric moves. So maybe you should place her on this blue Miracle tile behind me so that she can wait for me to defeat Cubone. It's a good position for her to attack Polybreak with super effective electric type moves after Cubone is down. There's also a green Miracle tile, but I'm, I'm not sure if it will help us here. You've impressed me with your knowledge, child. I should have expected this of the son of Sir Victorable. 
One last thing. Remember to talk to Team Mechia once you're finished. Very well, let us now begin the preparation. Check the game hints in the other menu to learn about more. To learn more. Yo, we are in Kodai Village Certified Warlord Tutorial Learning the Basics. Yo. Uh, you're in preparation phase. You can place your units on the battlefield by pressing A on an empty space or miracle tile. Empty spaces are marked with a dotted line, miracle tiles are marked with a colored arrow. Talk to Shimechi once you're done. Alright, red miracle tile boosts attack, blue defense, green miracle tile boosts speed, accuracy, and evasion. Combat phases, preparation phase, battle phase. Units will battle automatically, so preparation is key to victory. It's absolutely amazing what is possible with this game. So you know what? Um, that one holding the red miracle tile toggling moves. We only let it use these moves. Give item? Do I have an item? Uh, we give a power band because vine whip is physical. We place Pichu here. Um. Gonna leave these two enabled, because both end up being good. We give you a uh, a, a, a special band, probably. Okay, holding a special band, holding an item power band. Start battle. That is very cool. I'm ba- um, By the way, I should probably mention that I'm not doing anything right now. It's actually playing itself. Holy shit. Okay, there's some some music problems. That could probably be because I'm not using the newest version. Yeah, yeah, I'm probably going to switch after this to the newest version. Well, I actually think... Wait, are we softlock in here? Probably, yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, that, that is probably what... Uh, what was meant with soft lock in the second dungeon. Um, we are stuck here. So we're going to go and change it up to the newest version that had this uh, that has this fixed. It's uh, my fault. All right. All right. We are here back now on the um, fixed version that I didn't download for some reason. So yeah. Everything is set up the same. Ah, now that looks a lot different. Alright. Good, good, good. Good. Good hit, another good hit. We do do. That is absolutely amazing. Still, <laughs> we did it. Victory is ours, Bell Sprout. 
Forgive us, General Typhlosion. We have failed you. Poliwhack, what is happening to you? Don't leave me. I, I cannot stop the bleeding, Cubone. But my death will not be in vain. It will bring our land one step closer to victory. I am afraid my two bodies started falling apart. Let us die together. <laughs> what the fuck? Do not just about loyalty to other kingdoms or comrades who have given their life in battle. I'm sorry, get out of somewhere on. It appears that you would be a particularly strict father figure, General Saborot. Though I do envy the children for how cheerful uh, they can view even the most terrible things. Maybe we should protect their innocence until the day comes where they will face such harsh realities on their own. Is my child bothering you, General Zamorot? Do not be troubled. In fact, she's growing up to be a capable fighter. We're also in your debt for taking care of Bellsprout during his father's absence. No need to be humble, General. I will be by your side whenever you need assistance in battle. You can of course count on my help as well, General Zamorot. Scyther and the Raichu Squadron have joined your army. General Zamorot, Lord Scyther. <clears throat> I have come to report that the Fire Kingdom has started an invasion on the dryland shore. Good grief. So it is true. Spread the word across the village. General Zamorot, the dryland shore is located at our kingdom's border to the Sea of Wonders. So you can reach it by leaving the village over the southern gate. However, instead of defending against the Fire Kingdom, you might want to consider a surprise attack against the Grass Kingdom. Why would I do that? The border to that territory, the tree shroud path, the path can be reached per the eastern gate. But why would I attack the grass continent? Do not be concerned if you choose to go this way. The remaining villagers can fend on their own until you return. You can save the game in Samurai's house on the right side of the vi of the village. All right. Yes? Why can I... G General Zamorot, have you come to punish us? General Zamorot, sir. Please forgive us, we didn't mean to insult you and your precious dynasty. Fine. If you act, if you finally act, uh, get your act together. English. Thank you so much, General Zamorot. We will be forever in your debt. It appears that children cannot always be considered a blessing. <laughs> True. Is that right, true? When will father re finally return? Well, Sprout, I'm sure he'll be back soon. But don't worry, uh, no matter how long it takes, I'll take care of you until he's back. General Zamorot, you've seen how well I can fight. Let me join you and uh, kick some Fire Kingdom but I find your confidence almost admirable, but you will not. No, huh? Just wait until I've shown you what I'm made of, then you'll back me to join your army. <sighs> Two days, youth. Alright, anything else hidden in here? It has been years since the Fire Kingdom attack. Uh, I pray that you will escape your battles unscathed, General. I will be watching over ho -O until you come to battle. I will assist you whenever you need to manage your army. Ah, nice. It's the assembly, I see. So, I actually have no reason to attack the Grass Continent, I think. So, um, defend against the Fire Kingdom on Dryland Shore. Don't s you know the thing the thing I've learned as a German is do not start a two front war. It will not end up good. But this this is amazing man. Okay. I have on my team Wait I moves. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I will put you uh, I will put Frostless on here um, mostly with double team and powder snow um, what does zinc band do I have no idea all right we have a special attack which would be you we will get rid of tail whip and rid of Thunder shot. Maybe, maybe. I mean, tail, tail whip lowers physical. 
Not special. Um, but I guess... Uh, we could take can still be useful? Anyways, I give you um, a special band. Um, Scyther probably here. Um, vacuum wave, focus energy, probably not. Power band, you. Then I'm gonna place... Propass, he. Oh, other way, yeah. It may not be that intelligent to put... Cypher next to the Marcargo. Eh. What do you have? Iron defense, block, gravity. <laughs> no idea if this is going to work. But let's go. <laughs> Alright. So again, these should play... Automatically, I think. Good hit. What is Frostless doing? Frostless has a room attacking move, if I'm not mistaken. And they... Oh, that is not good! Okay. I mean, I would... I really enjoyed if it stopped using double team and actually used powder snow. I think I've lost that battle. If it's still using double team. You could have used now 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 it uses powder snow. Good dream. Alright. That's not the ending good. I would say one on one. Problem is, Powder Snow is dealing absolutely no damage. Fuck. Restart battle. Good. Okay, okay, I see. Uh, Frostless and Power Pass are switched. Interesting. Alright, 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 alright. Going to change you to Frostless. I'm going to put Scyther here. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. I'm going to put. Scythe probably actually here. Going to put Raichu in here. Then going to put Probopass in here. So I've seen that it is not intelligent. So I'm gonna do a double team. This may be intelligent, this may be stupid. I do not know. But I will give you... Um, the special band for extra damage on the powder snow. You just... I mean, you get physical boost. I should probably change... These two again. And then toggle moves... Probably like this... Yeah... Maybe this will work out... I don't know, let's go. The problem is that we are reliant on the PMD2 
AI. Hmm. Good. Already good hit. I have to get rid of Rhydon first, which is hopefully going to be happening. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. That's what I'm talking about. I do like it how Scyther is just chilling there and doing absolutely nothing, despite being at double speed and everything. But alright. Nice, that did it! Second preparation phase? Oh, alright, 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 alright. Um. You know what? I think we can actually leave it this way. I'm pretty confident. Especially in the powder snow. Yeah, like that's some huge damage on everyone. Gold Pass will probably end up tanking most of the hits, hopefully. Good, quite a lot of misses here. Another round of powder snow. Good, two almost, uh, two already down. Another round of powder snow, three down, two are frozen in place. Good. Move are back. Okay, we lost Scyther. But one more powder snow should hopefully do the job. Mm, not quite. But there comes Robopass with a critical tackle. Phew, these Fire Kingdom troops are getting more and more ferocious. But thanks to you, General Zamorot, we have fended off every single one of them. Let us rest for today, General. That is very cool. <laughs> I mean, that's, uh, that's basically what Sea of Time can do, I think. It's like rolling code for this game in C. Which is amazing. Uh, oh, is something hurting you? I cannot comprehend your pain. It is it is no use thinking about this. I'll show them. They have finally come to understand what I'm capable of. Ah, Pichu is doing dumb shit. Alright. Huh? Pichu? The next morning. Good morning, General. General Zamorot, the, the Grass Kingdom is attacking on Tree Shroud Path. Why is the Grass Kingdom now attacking on Tree Shroud? What, what did we do to the Grass Kingdom? <laughs> A Grass Kingdom attack, but our kingdom have been allies in the last war. It might be in response to yesterday's ambush. Huh? I didn't ambush them, though. Huh? Hey? Anyways, let us not waste more time. Uh, we must defend our borders on Free Road Path. General Zamorot, Lord Scyther. Have you seen Pichu? I cannot find her anywhere. I was unsure if I had only imagined it, but I think I saw Pichu heading towards Dryland Shore last night. Oh no, Pichu, why? If she's really headed towards Fire Kingdom territory, she, uh, she's in serious danger. Please, you must save her. Doing so would be a tantamount to, uh, to an attack on the Fire Kingdom, a tremendously risky maneuver. It is up to you to decide how we proceed, General Zamorot. Um. <sighs> not easy, not easy. Please, you must save, save Petru, else she'll surely die.
uh, leave to the Eastern Fan to attack Gira's Kingdom or to Salvon. We'll have to make a meaningful decision. Fuck you. We are counting on you. Hard. It's, it's actually a hard decision. Because I imagine if I do not defend against the Grass Kingdom, this town here, uh, this uh, Kodai village falls. But if I don't rescue Petru, Petru fucking dies. <laughs> Damn, fuck it. Yeah, alright, alright. I'm, I'm going for Petru. Well, I think we're going to go with the same setup we had before. Oh, wait. Scyther should be on here. Um, the power band. Brossless, item special band. And on here, then. Probo pass. Moves still are the same. The defense scarf. And on here, last but not least, Raichu with... Uh, no, fuck. Uh, pressed the wrong button. Ooh, special band just... I think the Zingbang is the only left. Alright, 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 alright. Um, and then here, Scyther. Start battle. Huh? What? Wh where's Scyther? I think we actually... I mean, I assume that is an oversight that Scyther is not here anymore. But that is going to be a problem. Do I now get at least Scyther back? Yeah, now everyone is back, alright. It does look like it's an oversight that uh, Scyther is not added back to the team. But anyways, this round should hopefully... Ah. Go a bit better. Never mind, we already lost Probopass. That is not good. That is not good. Oh, and it's spamming rock polish. Please just get on one powder snow. Thank you. Good. That is good. That is very, very good. Good, good, good. Kill them. Yes. Welcome, we've been awaiting you. I found this child of your kingdom slipping around our borders. It seems desperate to join ours. Pichu. General Zamurot, please help me. They are forcing me to fight by their sight. Yo. Silence, your local lies. Uh, your locality lies with the Fire Kingdom now. Resist once more and I shall engulf your body in flames. Pichu, we are coming to save you. Please endure just a little longer. You, lead the child out of our disputes. As the saying goes, all is fair in love and war. We will break both your spirits and bones to guarantee our victory. P please forgive me. <laughs> if, if I don't, they will kill me. Alright. Okay, okay, I see what we're in. But I think they're... Uh, the thing is, I do want to have Frostless absolutely buffed. Because of Powder Snow. And I 
I'm pretty sure I cannot move the blue field. Um, but that means it's going to end up directly in Houdoom's face, which is fire type, which is bad. But I guess I have to try it. I really like the music. Ah, fucking Frostless is dead. Not good. <laughs> Alright. But this may end up actually with a win if we're lucky. Because we're about to take down Ampharos, if I'm seeing that correctly. We do have some glitch icons and sprites. I guess it's a side effect of Sea of Time. Or actually what he did in there. But I think this could actually end up with a win. Come on. Okay, down to two Pokemon, not good. Down to one Pokemon, even worse. Down to zero. Fuck. Okay. Mm. This could have just been bad RNG though, so uh, yeah, let's go, try this again. Because I have no idea if I could make a better setup than this. Alright, alright, it starts definitely different, besides the fact that Frostless is dead. But Houndoom seems to be trying to run to Probopa and Probopa. Okay, actually, this is starting out much worse. Alright, oh, that is fucking bad. Uh, not good. Absolutely not good. Shit. Alright, you know what? We'll see us again once I'm. Uh, once I win this battle. Yes! No matter what you will try, the child's wounds will stay forever open. Just you wait. General Typhlosion will break you further. You will know nothing but pain. You have obtained the item Scope Lens! Alright. And uh, things are glitching out of even more, alright. Thank you so much for saving me, General Zamorot. It was so scary. Are your wounds still hurting, Pichu? Only a bit. I too owe you my gratitude once again, General. We could consider ourselves fortunate for having you. Come now, you need rest. Alright, General Zamorot. I've come to inform you Armaldo's squadron has fallen while defending the Tree Shroud Path. They died protecting what they cherished the most. We will put their souls to rest in the Golden Tower. I understand. Thank you, Chimecho. Let us rest for today, General. Interest someone? Okay, interesting. Those were pretty fascinating times. But might I ask what this story has to do with your ancestors? Patience, the story is not over yet. But it's but it is getting late. I will take you English. I will take the leave now and continue tomorrow. Alright, see you then. Actually, it is quite a long way back home. I hereby declare this meeting a sleepover, if you do not mind. <laughs> you want to sleep here? Uh, sure? <laughs> Sleeping on the table. 
<laughs> All right. To be continued. And that is the end of this demo. Thank you for playing. The sake was only possible thanks to assets and patches made by the community. Please check, uh, check the credits file in the zip file. Uh, you can now talk to the inhabitants of the village uh, again and save your progress. Please look forward to the full release. I do. I really do. Okay, General Zamorod, leave the village through the southern gate to defend against the grass kingdom or to the east to check the fire kingdom, which would give us an advantage in this war. You will have to make a meaningful decision. We are counting on you. Okay, these should be dead. Alright. I don't know. Anyway, we're going to save. Ooh. It's not taken that well. Alright. And with that, we have reached the end of Rainbow Heritage. A technically very, very amazing hack with a nice story. Um, but I think the, the actually best and worst part of this game is that you have to rely on US's AI, which is terrible. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I think uh, it still works fine. But yeah, with that, I can say I hope you enjoyed this game as much as I did. And until the next time, I wish you a great day, night, evening, whatever at. Bye.